big teddy. <coughs> Rose is happy because we found an Indian restaurant in Poitiers. Indian restaurant, Kingfisher beer. Very happy man. And you've got a chicken madras? Chicken madras with Kashmiri rice and a butter naan. And I've got crevette madras, but not as strong as yours. And there was one problem. Curry, white shirt. <laughs> it's not good. <laughs> we'll keep you updated. <laughs> did you enjoy that? Certainly did. That was absolutely lovely. It was. We would have shown you empty plates, but they've gone. But um, the shirt survived, so all round, it's a good day. Okay, we've just had a delivery. It's a little lawnmower that we've ordered. Um, we've got the ride-on mower, but that doesn't get us into all the little areas, I'm afraid. Uh, the strimmer's not necessarily a good substitute for a little lawnmower. And if I just show you this, poking around the corner, it's the lawnmower we brought with us. Um, from the UK it's just a little lawnmower but to be quiet it's been playing up and I think it's going to cost far too much to repair and it's very old so reluctantly we've bought another one <laughs> Perfect way to keep a woman happy, bar a lawnmower, and if not a lawnmower, a strimmer. <laughs> She's enjoying that, so is Max, look at him, he's going loony. Go on Maxie boy. Oh, well, one happy lady. This has got a bit out of hand because we didn't get a chance to do it last year. Yeah. And there's a load of creeper growing in it and weeds. All this. Yeah. Yeah, it's getting a bit... And it needs um, wiring up to the wall, really. Okay. Um, yeah, because last year when we moved in, we didn't even know this was here. Um, there was just shrubs all over the place and then suddenly a few weeks later we've got loads of lovely roses but uh, it's just years of overgrowth isn't it mm. there's all the creeper growing in here and weeds and it's come so far forward it all needs wiring back up to the wall really yeah because we're at good seven or eight feet yeah in front of the wall here so it's just been allowed to get out of hand i don't know what that is what's that i think it's it looks like asparagus actually yeah asparagus fern i don't know i don't know okay well, well that's there's a, there's a few bits okay so we need to tie it back strim try and clear all the overgrowth underneath um 
and yeah. that's today's task and then of course we've got it all down here as well there's my hollyhocks <coughs> growing here which i noticed last year there's hollyhocks two. there's one there and there's one round here. okay so we're keeping those yeah yeah and i can take some seeds off them this year oh, okay so we need to decide what to tie back and yeah. what not because this is there's there's a load of ivy growing up there and creeper there's ivy up above your head as well yeah well that's that's, that's coming from next door but that's going to okay that's for another day but uh, right now let's just um decide what we need to tie up and mm. all that sort of stuff look at these they're beautiful they're like rosettes they, they are, haven't they? really got a scent but they're so pretty yeah i mean even that one you just touched it's just hanging right over yeah, isn't it so and, and this one's coming over yeah above this one above like an arch. okay so that's try and tidy this lot up that's the task for the day mm. right okay i'll go get my gear It's going to be quite a task just getting to the wall actually to uh, put some wires up. But I'm not sure what these are here. I'll we'll have to find out. I thought they were some kind of fuchsia, but I'm not sure. Oh, okay. Okay, before we can tie anything up, I think we've got to just try and clear as much of the stuff here that's not necessary. There's there's plants growing amongst this rose, so got to sort that out first, I think. thought might have been a wild asparagus is actually a fennel sweet fennel. sweet fennel so that's worth keeping I think so we'll work around that one as well idea cleared a lot of that uh, vine that was on the back of the ivy cleared around the base Baxter's just inspecting our work as the usual so that's these two that are now able to breathe and grow 
we've um, had to be a little bit brutal with this one there was a lot of dead wood on here so we've trimmed it back as best we can without losing it um, and this one there's a few more bits to take off because it's it is a bit woody in the middle but it's it's looking better now and I'm sure it'll prosper more now it's, it's able to breathe well it started off as a grey day but it's absolutely glorious now it's getting a little bit hot so we're gonna take five Well, I think we're going to call it a day today. We've been at it quite a few hours. We didn't quite get it finished at the other end, but I'll show you that in a sec. But just to recap, so this hollyhock, we've managed to save that and get rid of all the growth around that. Likewise, this rose here and all the vine and ivy on the back. We've completely freed this rose up. This plant, I'm not sure what it is, Susie did say earlier actually. Um, we've managed to free that up and separate it from this rose. We've strimmed around the base of it and you can see all these petals where we've been just ripping this vine out. Um, we've lost a few but there's plenty there still. Uh, so we haven't quite managed to get to this end but you can see we've taken all of the vine off the back wall from all the way down right to this point here. So we've just got to make a path in through here so we can get behind there and then separate this rose from this rose and clear all the dead stuff out. So I think we can safely say we're happy with ourselves today. It's a lot of work, it's getting very hot and it's years of neglect that we're trying to put right in one day. So, But overall we're really happy. Now I think we're going to sit down for 10 minutes and have a little rest, have a little break. And a very nice lady commented on Susie's shirt, uh, her top, and it, she quoted never underestimate, but she never read the rest of it, so I suspect she couldn't see it. So here it is in all its glory. Never underestimate. <laughs> Put my teeth in. Never underestimate the power of a woman with her Cavalier King Charles Spaniel. Perfect. <laughs> More for the dechettery. And there's the start of the next pile, <laughs> never ending. That was hard going. 
Yeah, it was, but it's a job we've been wanting to do, isn't it? And, uh, it's a bit hot this afternoon. Yeah, it suddenly turned really hot, so... But I, I've been struggling. I woke up this morning and my Achilles heel's hurting for some reason. Probably overdid it yesterday. And I think you've got what they call a baker's cyst on the back of your knee. Yeah, which it's... can be quite painful. Suddenly pops this week, so... So we were right <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> but there you go, that's life. It's a little bit of a shorter video this week, but uh, as you know, we've been really hectic the last 10 days. Uh, but hopefully we'll gain some time now because we don't actually have to go back to Quatia until September. Mm. So yeah. that's, uh, that's going to free us up quite a lot. Uh, so normal service shall be resumed very soon. When, so. we, when we get the mower working. Oh, yeah. Yeah, the, the new one we ordered broke <laughs> on its first try. <laughs> so yeah. we dug out our old mower which is probably over 25 years old and we think we've put it back together okay yeah so we're going to try it out this afternoon we think we may have saved its life but uh, yeah the, 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 that one um, not long after the footage that we showed you um, a spring fell off it and, uh, and then the, the belt came then off. the belt came off because the spring was the tensioner for it and well, uh, it we wasn't worth see trying to get where back. It went, but it wasn't cheap, and I just thought it's not. It's not our problem. No. So it's going back. We bought it on Amazon, so that's going back. So yeah, it's been <laughs> one of those weeks, really. But anyway, we've got through that, and um, normal service shall be resumed. Right now, we've got a glass of water. <laughs> and we're celebrating with water. That's how <laughs> rock and roll we are. Yeah, <laughs> and Lexi's actually. Oh, you made her jump. Oh. She's under the camera in the shade. Yeah, she's very sensible. And the the boys have gone inside. I, I think I don't know where they are. Yeah. <laughs> so um, we shall see you Wednesday. Yeah. On time. <laughs> okay. Bye. Bye. Chanté.